This is my daughter's guinea pig. Um, Benson. <clears throat> he doesn't like sort of yeah, being petted too much, but I'll try to get him to calm down as well. Yeah, looks a bit mean, but got to kind of force him down for a second just so I can just get him to calm first. <laughs> but anyway. All right. <clears throat> I'm getting there now. So a thing you can do if you're trying to calm an animal down is like a heartbeat. You know, you got tap, tap, you know, pause, pause. Tap, tap, pause, pause. Tap, tap, pause, pause. Tap, tap, pause, pause. Tap, tap, pause, pause. So <clears throat> what it does is it kind of emulates the heartbeat when we're, <clears throat> when we're in the womb. And um, it should calm down pretty much any mammal. So it works for us humans too, which is great. It's all right, buddy. Hey. Another thing you can do too, which will calm an animal, you can try humming. Just go, ooh. And then just try to send the animal some like love and calm energy. Come on, buddy. Hey. Come on. Hey, hey, hey. I love with guinea pigs, they cute little feet. Look at that. They look really amazing. Mm -hmm. Hang on, Richard. Mm -hmm. Enough now, is that good? Yeah, come on, you're right up there. There you go. <laughs> this guy's way too fat. <clears throat> I stopped feeding him pellets and I had him out on the grass for a bit, but all he does is sit there and just munches out on grass flat out. Alright, yeah, have a good day. <clears throat> go try to calm down an animal. It's good fun. Hang on, Richard, I've got to go calm. <coughs> hey, excuse me. <coughs> Have a good afternoon.